the karmic wants revenge, but the universe is blocking them. So there's a third party who's out for revenge, maybe against you or against somebody else. But the universe is blocking this person. And you got being blackmailed in the reverse. So this could be... I feel like this is a karmic energy who wants revenge on somebody who they were blackmailing. And maybe they not black maybe whoever they were blackmailing is like, look, I'm fucking tired. Or somebody is being blackmailed. So there is a karmic who wants revenge, but the universe is blocking them. This person could be blackmailing somebody external to you or I don't know what's going on. Let's see first. They have been exposed. Oh, child. So a karmic energy has been exposed this weekend. That's what's going on this weekend. A karmic is being exposed for blackmailing. Maybe somebody to be with them. Look, child, their person is dirty. They have a bad body odor. Oh, child. <laughs> Baby, so there is a karmic out here who is nasty. This person is dirty. They have a bad body odor, and they being exposed, baby. Tables have now turned. They are on the bottom of the wheel, baby. And whoever this karmic energy is, now they are on the bottom of the wheel. Because I feel like whoever your person is, they want to get, they want to come back towards you. So you're in separation from somebody who wants you back. Nothing will keep me from getting you back. This person could have been being blackmailed by a karmic in the past, but now the tables are turning because this karmic is being exposed. Whatever your person was being blackmailed about, it's coming out. So it's like they can't hold it over this person's head no more. The karmic can't hold it over this person's head no more. But whoever this karmic energy is, oh baby, they dirty. They got a badass body. Hell to look. Your per look, they stink. Your person don't want to be with somebody who stank. <laughs> They with the karmic energy and they are miserable as fuck. And see, look, y'all on the right path, 1212. You could have been seeing 1212. Well, if you have spirit said, you on the right path. So blessings and love and life are coming to you. You know what I'm saying? Because now where you were on the bottom of the wheel in the past, now you're on the top of the wheel. And whoever was on the top, now they at the bottom. And I feel like it's a third party, or it could even be your person collective. I'm just saying, you got broken, shattered, and destroyed. So your person probably is in this broken, shattered, and destroyed ass energy because it's like they want you back. So I don't know what happened for them to leave you or, or what caused the separation, but now they want you back. And ain't nothing going to stop this person from trying to get you back. <laughs> but there's a karmic energy this weekend who's been exposed. Look, and this person is going crazy, baby. The third party going crazy. Not only are they going crazy, they're probably going crazy because your person could be out here telling people that this person got a bad body. <laughs> they could be out here telling people that this person is nasty. <clears throat> Again, this karmic could have been talking about you in the past. You know what I'm saying? Now the table done turned. Now people talking about them, talking about how dirty they is. And baby, this karmic is going crazy because they want revenge, but they can't get revenge because they being exposed. Look, you have made this person a believer, child. Yeah, y'all done made somebody a believer, whether it's a karmic energy or your person. Whoever it is, you done made their ass a believer. Your past person done seen a karmic's true colors now they feeling broken and shattered and destroyed within because they went toward this little dirty nasty karmic and now this karmic is going crazy because now your person is seeing straight through them and don't want to be with them no <laughs> baby so it's somebody's going through some drama this weekend that's what's going to be happening this weekend Shit. A karmic being exposed. Okay, now that's just too many. A karmic being exposed and going crazy because they being exposed. They want revenge, but they can't get revenge, especially if they're trying to get revenge on you because you on your right path. And the universe is not going to allow this person anywhere near you. <laughs> Shit. What is going on for the weekend? Child? See what I'm saying? Y'all protected. White feathers. Y'all could be seeing white feathers all the time. You are protected. There is a karmic energy going around lying about everything. And it's because this person is going crazy because they losing your person. And they losing your person because your person done found out some type of truth about their ass. Look, white feathers, a lot of angelic protection. Oh, so you are protected. 
A lot of y'all were protected as look, you could be dealing with a fire sign or you a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Look, drug addict, pills, powder, gas, meth, they do it all. Oh, child. Oh, I feel like there's a third party. This third party could be out here telling people that you out here doing all these drugs. You a drug addict. But baby, the truth has done been seen. The truth has been exposed. It's them. They the one who 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 a drug addict. That's why they got this bad ass body odor because they do anything for a piece of change. <laughs> They do anything for a fucking piece of change. And now they being exposed. Mm. Mm. Karmic is a little slow. Low IQ. No common sense. Yeah, this 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 karmic energy is somebody who has no common sense whatsoever, collective. <clears throat> mm. No whatsoever. And they broke as fuck. They stunting acting like they got got it, but they really don't. This person could be 23, 48, 54, 27, 36, 61, or 33, but they immature. Their age don't make them mature. It's their actions. And obviously their actions is shit. If they are liar and they blackmail people, they they obviously not a good person <laughs> look fraudulent couple getting exposed for everything and if your person was dealing with this 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 karmic energy and they was doing dirt with this karmic energy oh they being exposed they are being exposed your person right along with this third party is being exposed and maybe because they being exposed they want to come back towards you but baby, y'all done made somebody a believer. Y'all could have told this person. They're, that that person you dealing with, they a drug addict. They a hoe. They lie about everything, but your person didn't believe them. Now they seeing the truth. Because this third party is being exposed. Now they see the truth. <laughs> your person that is, look, baby, I'm ready. Quit playing, LaVert. Now they ready to come towards you and beat you. Get the fuck out of here. They... Now they ready to fix what they broke with you. Now they ready because you have made this person a believer. Y'all told this person. Y'all told y'all person, look, you you gonna want me back. You going over there being with them. Everybody done had them. Every, <clears throat> and they probably said what well, shit. They said the same thing about you. I don't know why I'm doing this little scenario, but this must have happened. But come to find out. The third part of comic was a hoe. Everybody had this person, and your person is looking stupid because they chose a karmic energy over you. Y'all headed in the right fucking direction. Y'all were on top of the wheel, and now they on the bottom of the wheel, and they looking back thinking like, damn, what happened? Well, what happened was <laughs> you chose a liar. You chose somebody who was a drug addict, who was, and if they wasn't a drug addict, they was just like, it. You know, they had addictions. They were toxic. Put it like that. They just had toxic traits. Whatever those traits were. Some of y'all, it could it could have been drugs. Others of y'all, it was just they loved to lie. But now they being exposed. Look, moon magic being done. This person trying to do magic on y'all and everything. But again, white feathers. Y'all got a lot of angelic <laughs> And this person is mad, but remember the first card that came out is the karmic wants revenge, but the universe is blocking them. So baby, there is a karmic who is out for revenge, but all they do is all they doing is putting coal on their own head. If they out here doing moon magic, it's gonna backfire because y'all want y'all right path and y'all got a lot of angelic protection. <clears throat> so they better be careful. They trying to stop this past person, your past person from coming towards you. You know what I'm saying? Because <laughs> Because I look, I heard they don't want to take the foul by themselves. So your person was doing done got caught up in something with this third party, and this third party don't want to take the rap by themselves. They don't want to take the rap by themselves. <clears throat> heart chakra activation. So your person is going through a heart chakra chakra activation, and that's why they are now able to see that this karmic person was nothing but a, a wolf in sheep's clothing. Ready to make up for lost time with you. Is it possible? possible so now that you've made this person a believer now they want you back <laughs> look again okay i think this was already down there broke stunting fake as fuck so they <clears throat> they broke and no i don't need no honey y'all i'm smoking okay okay for everybody who out there is a, is a, a medical doctor 
You're not a weed connoisseur, obviously. You know what I'm saying? I keep clearing my throat because it's just this good gas caught in my throat. <laughs> so I have to let y'all know periodically that I'm okay. It's just this good gas, okay? Okay, the y'all weed gonna be lit because I feel like y'all gonna y'all gonna probably hear about this shit. Y'all gonna probably hear about this shit. Being apart from you is making me a better person. I will be back. Y'all gonna hear from this person. Whoever your past person is, you're gonna hear about everything that's going on. Everything that this karmic person did, you're gonna hear about it if you already have them. Baby, because they been exposed. Everything that's coming out. All the secrets are being exposed. And your person was probably being blackmailed, but look, game over. Game over. Because your person is seeing things from a different perspective. <clears throat> They they can't take being apart from you too much more long. Cause shit. So what is going on for the weekend? What do the collective need to know or be aware of? Open yourself up to someone different. Karmic soul contract. So your person is now being told to open themselves up to somebody different. They have paid a karmic debt. It's over. This karmic situation that your person got themselves into, it's over. They have paid their debt. Look, your person is going through a rebirth. And as they go through this rebirth, they're trying to contemplate on how to come back and sit towards you <clears throat> to fix what they broke. Look, because a lot of y'all are closed off. You got your feelings on safety. <laughs> But you protect it. You are guarded towards your past person because I guess what they put you through. But baby, this comic and, and her friend, you got two broke hoes doing spell work, Googling spell work, trying to do spell work towards you, baby. They doing the most. But nothing is working because again, y'all are protected by the divine. The universe is blocking these two broke hoes from doing this spell work. This comic and her home girl. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga and they home boy and they being exposed for being for doing spell work too and not only trying to do it on you but trying to do it on your person look you are loved <coughs> yeah and that's what they hate they hate that people love you look scared and shocked I miss you too more than you think yeah your person is <laughs> coming back towards you because they love you and there's a karmic energy who know that this person loves you and they mad <clears throat> they are out for fucking revenge they out for blood baby because they being left behind they being left behind and they feeling some type of way look the karma they are getting may cause suicidal thoughts yeah baby see and that's the thing they out here trying to do spell work towards you seeing you the evil eye and shit hoping that you fail or like this person don't want to come back to you but all this shit is just backfiring because y'all got this protection around y'all and this person is mad this they mama doesn't like you and didn't want y'all together some of y'all the third party karmic energy is a mother figure child but your wishes are about to be granted and your person is fucking embarrassed and humiliated that they was fucking listening to their mama or listening to this third party in the past because again the distance between you and this person is fucking killing them and they coming back look wow some of y'all your person could have went through a near-death experience that something could have happened where this person had to rethink their life and they realized that they want to be with you they choose you and this karmic is pissed off about it everything blew up in their face everything blew up in the karmic face everything blew up in your person face whatever they thought they was gonna do whatever they thought they was gonna have however they thought they was gonna live all that shit blew up it's done finished look and now the karmic is in fucking despair about to lose everything including their motherfucking mind what little bit of sense they do have they losing it Look, and y'all just in this energy of not giving no fucks. Cause y'all y'all chose yourself a long time ago. Y'all chose yourself a long time ago. Yeah, y'all give no fucks, baby. And this karmic low key, they 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 feeling you, divine feminine. Male or female, whoever the karmic is in your personal life, oh, they look at you sideways like, mm, I fuck with them if they would fuck with me. Yeah, know that. <laughs> know that. Especially if they're an earth sign or you are earth sign, Gemini Libra Aquarius. <laughs> But just know new love is coming your way. So some of y'all gonna have a past person come back. But some of y'all gonna be the new person. This person may be a Capricorn. Look. But just be careful. <laughs> 
be careful because they 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 sex might be trash. So don't don't rush into something with this new person. Don't rush into sex with this new person. <laughs> you know, shit. Chad, I don't know why. In my head, I'm hearing "Look before you leap." Chad, <laughs> y'all, this is so fucking funny. <laughs> got two broke hoes that's pissed off mad and want retaliation because obviously they lost at whatever game they were playing then you got your person who's over here fucking your past person who's fucking miserable because they want to be with you and fix something between you and them but y'all just like mm, I got my feelings on safety <laughs> so I don't go shoot yeah y'all guard it y'all guard it <laughs> and this person your person they can't take it look heartbreak and I make it up. They can't take it. Because they believe you now. You made this person a believer. I don't know what the fuck you told this person. Whatever you told them. Yeah. <laughs> they believe you now. <laughs> Look, healing. See what I'm saying? Wounds improving, mending, progress. And this person is now ready to mend this situation between you and them. Again, child, they want your forgiveness. This person is healing. Look. <laughs> This could be your soulmate. This could be your twin. You and this person got a soul contract. Now, they did have a karmic soul contract with a karmic energy. But that's done. That that debt has been paid. And it's time for your person to move on. But there's a third party who was trying to hold on to your person. And was blackmailing them too. And if this was a fucking mama. This is a, like a low vibrational toxic ass mama. Who did not want their son or their daughter to, to be happy because they fucking miserable. See what I'm saying? Break up, child. But all that's coming to an end. Well, that, whoever this comic is, whether it's platonic or romantic, it's done. It's over. <laughs> Break up. Mm -hmm. See what I'm saying? And y'all just in this guarded ass energy. Y'all may miss this person a little bit, but y'all, I don't feel like y'all miss them to the point to where you just gonna take them back, like, just take them back. Truth. Unless they come in talk, speaking the truth. Unless they come in being honest. <laughs> and I feel like this is somebody who is going to come towards you being honest after going through a lot of bullshit with a third party. <laughs> they, yeah. They gonna come towards you with, you know, I'm very guarded toward this person. Yeah, they're watching you, crushing they're a little nervous with the with the secret crush with the butterflies. So they just you know admiring you from afar right now. They just watching you. But they are fucking shattered. <laughs> they are broken, destroyed within <laughs> over everything that they got going this weekend. And y'all just it protected. Y'all just living y'all life, not giving no fucks, doing y'all thing. Look, I, baby, I'm telling y'all, some of y'all got new love coming in. Or your past person gonna try to come towards you in new energy. That person that put you in the third party. <clears throat> and you're gonna be guarded against this person because you're gonna feel like there's a third party. But your person doesn't change. Or they trying to change. And that's just for some of y'all. Look, and this person is stressing. Your person is stressing because they don't know if you've met somebody new and 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 you moving on or if you just holding back from them because you know you don't want to be with them, but they feel like y'all meant to be together. <laughs> yeah, so this weekend, your person is going to be in their feelings over this connection that they have with you because you done made them some type of believer. Again, I don't know what you told this person or what you said to this person, but whatever was said, it's all coming true. It's all coming true. And this person is so fucking embarrassed. They are embarrassed because they fell for a wolf in sheep's clothing. And then they probably went along with breaking the law, doing things that this third party wanted them to do. And now they being exposed. Like, they are embarrassed because people are seeing them for what? Oh, they being exposed. They being exposed. Especially if they got over on people. <clears throat> if they were doing spell work. Like, whatever was going on, if they was doing spell work for you to be, you know, whatever, it's happening to them. And, baby, they is hot. They is hot. They hot. See what I'm saying? It's it's done. It's done. Baby, they, your person walking away. That's, that's done. 
they plan to contract this over, man. It, and they coming towards you. Now, I don't know if they coming towards you and you're going to give them a chance or not. I just know that they coming towards you. See what I'm saying? They walking away from this toxic ass relationship that they in with this karmic person. <laughs> Again, romantic or platonic. They walking away because it's toxic as fuck. It was never supposed to last a long time. It was just supposed to last long enough for your person to learn the lesson. And I feel like they learned the lesson. Because you done made them a believer. Now it's time for them to walk away from this person one more. Look, can I make it up? Now it's time. In the past, you and this, I don't know what happened, but it was wrong time. My person, wrong time. Now, perf now it's perfect timing because your person is walking away from a toxic ass relationship. The person that they dealing with, who who got the dark attachments, this low IQ, this slow ass third party, who was nasty out here in these streets, nasty with this bad body odor, trying to do Google spell work. They walking away from this toxic person. <laughs> And y'all just out here living y'all life, enjoying y'all life, chilling with friends and shit, and you're going to get a message from this person, and it's going to shock the fuck out y'all for real. When you hear from this person, you're going to be like, what? I can't believe they called me. I can't believe him, is, him and her broke up. I can't believe her. She finally left that nigga. I promise you. it's it's Y'all going to be shook. When this person reach out to y'all. Let's see what's going on. So what's going on in this situation? What's the tea? Cause baby, this weekend, look, child, look, crying over you. Mm, told you. Yeah, so this weekend, y'all person gonna be crying over you. Do they believe you now? They believe you now. They got this old drug addict ass, toxic man or woman over here. What they dealing with? Who stink, might I add? <laughs> Trying to just like keep them stuck and trying to keep them with them. And baby, the person is like, no, I don't want to be with you. I don't want you. What part don't you understand? I don't want to be with you. <laughs> the corpus is like, yeah, you want to be with me. You got me fucked up. You do love me. <laughs> the person is like, no, the fuck I don't. <laughs> and for some of y'all, this is the comic is one of your fake ass friends that your person could be creeping with. I'm just saying. Could be somebody that's in your circle, spinning and grinning in your motherfucking face, but they talking about you behind your motherfucking back. Hustler, emotional, manipulator. Yeah, some of y'all, this is <sighs> child. Some of y'all, your person was listening to a fake ass friend when they went toward this person. It was because they was being hustled. The person who told them to go toward this third party was the emotional manipulator back there. And your person, look, that's why they end up taking that dirty offer from this corner. Because they was listening to the wrong goddamn person, child. And for some of y'all, it's they mama. Shit. Mm -hmm. They was trying to see it, it was it was something in it for them. If this was a mother figure, yep, I block. See, they didn't want this person with you. Because it was something else that they wanted from this other person. And they was hustling your person. That's what made your person accept a dirty alpha from a dirty ass person. Look, they seeing that that person live a whole double fucking life. I'm telling you, they being exposed, Black Widow. And they see how they take advantage of people, manipulate people, blackmail people to get what they want, do spell work and shit. Look, now they want you back. Now they want you back. <laughs> Look. This person is being haunted by the memory of you, and all they do is think about you. But it's it's it was them. It was meant to happen this way. Something was meant to happen a particular way, and I feel like whatever happened between you and your person to make them a believer. Oh yeah, they believe you. Co-parenting issues. So if this is a baby mama, baby daddy dynamic, they not getting along at all, and and they t using the baby as leverage against each other. Look, you got thieves, so somebody's a thief. Somebody a thief. I said, if your person and this third party was, you know, doing stuff, scamming people, trying to get up on people, they done been found out. And they got a lot of people that's pissed off. Bogus healer. Some of these people could be talking to somebody, but the person that they talking to is bogus. Like, if they into, again, if they into, like, moon magic and shit like that, or they googling spell work, the person that they talking to and getting advice from, they bogus as fuck. <laughs> Look, blackmail. I told you, somebody getting blackmail, but it's all coming out. 
look ass kiss in here. It's, it's all coming out. And I feel like it, it got a lot to do with a karmic energy, a third party energy that was very shallow. This person was a gold digger. Yeah. They thought they was going to get some motherfucking money, but see, they done got caught red fucking handy. Even your person done caught, got caught red handy. And now they feel in some type of way. Now they feel in some type of way. They want to come back towards you and, and make something right with you, but they already know that your feelings on safety when it comes to them. You ain't finna fuck with them. Especially after fucking with this old dirty ass bad body built, bad body older person that they was dealing with that y'all told them not to fuck with. Y'all told y'all person that this person was nasty and they still fucked with this person. Mm -hmm. I did. But now somebody being blackmailed. Baby, this is ridiculous. Baby, somebody's going through a lot of drama this weekend. Let's put it like that. Somebody's going to face a lot of fucking drama over the choices that they fucking made. And it's not going to be fucking pretty at all. Like, the truth is coming out about uh, this this purse, this karmic energy that your person is dealing with. Like, they are really being exposed, baby. Your person, I kind of feel like your person is feeling some type of way collective. But it's, everything was supposed to happen in divine timing. All this was supposed to happen in divine timing. So, I don't know what happened to make your person a believer. Oh, but they're believing now. They, they, I bet they wish they weren't listening to these fake-ass friends. <laughs> Fake ass family members, this mama, you know what I'm saying? Because now the one person that they do want, which is you, you guarded against them. You don't want to have nothing to do with them right now. You know what I'm saying? Even if you do still love this person, you just know that they was dealing with somebody who was nasty. And y'all like, mm -mm. and y'all being protected too. But well, baby, this person, mm -mm, not so much. <laughs> not so much. But well, baby. Karmic want revenge, bad in the bitch, but the universe like, no, nah, bitch. You can't touch the collective, goddamn me. Because <laughs> they under our protection. <laughs> and baby, the karmic is mad. They mad. So that them and they home, girl, they doing spell work, or they trying to, but it ain't doing nothing but backfiring. It ain't doing nothing but backfiring, and now they embarrassed. Everybody find out the, and seeing the truth about them, child. Everybody. So let's see what's going on. What else? What are the weekend vibes? What do the collective need to know or be aware of? What's the T E A? Covering up lies. <laughs> I told you, baby, somebody is going through it this weekend. Baby, this comic is being exposed. There's a comic energy being exposed. Them and their friends. Them and the people who try to help them. Blackmail somebody or keep somebody stuck. Now they could have did this to multiple people, but it's all coming out. Damn, kids talk. Look, I'm telling you, it's gonna even be some kids that's gonna tell on these karmics. Yeah, my mama was in there doing this, and she had this hug, her hunger. Out the mouth the babes. Ain't that what the mama said? Some of y'all, there's gonna be some kids that get a karmic caught up. <laughs> so yeah. What else? What's going on this weekend? That the collective need to know be aware of it. So pay attention to these kids. Don't just be listening, thinking, "Oh, that's cute, baby." Y'all better be listening to what they saying, cause baby, some kids is about to spill the tea here. <laughs> oh, baby, they finna tell it. They gonna let you know. Some, my mama is sleeping with her home girl. They more than friends. Or yeah, my daddy. They was in the room and I heard. Damn, I'm sorry, I'm just. But whatever your situation is, baby, I'm telling you, somebody about to be exposed. Somebody is about to be exposed, and it's going to be some kids that expose them, too. Ooh, alien lovers, extraterrestrial child. And these are going to be two people that don't even, you would never think in a million years that they fuck with each other. Mm -mm, baby, but the kids is about to sound the alarm. Look. Mm. They fucking. So there's a third party that's about to be exposed for sleeping with somebody who they act like they don't like in no shape, form, or fashion. But these people are sleeping together. Ooh. They sleeping together. And y'all finna hear about it from some kids. 
hyped up on love. Mm, mm, mm. And whoever this person is, they love that person. So I feel like they don't love your person. If this is a karmic energy, they in love with whoever they creeping with. This person that's supposed to be their friend, they in love with that person. Words held against you. Mm. Yeah, and anything that they don't say it against you is being blocked. Any lies that they don't told on you, they could have said that you was the one sleeping with one of your friends collective, and that's not the truth. Goody good girl. See what I'm saying? Yeah, you ain't got nothing to do with that negative ass energy, that negative behavior. You're a good girl. This third party, they are the ones who are going around having all these sexual encounters. And baby, they kids about to get them caught up. Sexy as hell without trying. Some of these people, they just look good and they get a lot of attention. But they got a void that they try to fill with sex and it's not being filled at all. Got him whipped. But for some of y'all, that may be what lured your person in and this this karmic energy could have had good sex but it looked like they got good sex with everybody whisper sweet nothing <laughs> tempted as fuck John. can't help it still into you and the mask dishonesty oh yeah yeah baby see your person got played they got played by somebody who used sex as a fucking weapon to get them will to get them stuck and then to try to destroy them but your, the mask is coming off the mask is coming off your person is no longer sleeping with this person they constantly thinking about you collect. <laughs> look they constantly thinking about you but y'all constantly looking at y'all looking at this third party like bitch you keep testing me I'm going to show you <laughs> so this weekend y'all may hear from a karmic energy or y'all may hear something from some kids about a karmic energy, but I'm telling y'all, they they use sex as a weapon. They could have tried to say that you was this type of person, that you was, you know, somebody who slept around, but that's far from the truth. You're nothing like them. It's them, and they finna be exposed. And again, they're gonna be exposed by some kids. Uh, let's get some tarot. Well, I'm just, I'm just really reading. I'm just seeing what the story, what the story is. What the weekend energy looking like? Cause baby, I didn't know what to record. I just said, let me record. <laughs> so let's get some tarot and see what is going on. Let's see what's going on. What do the collective need to know or be aware of for the weekend? Look, the past returning or trying to return. Six of cups. <laughs> Somebody from your past. Trying to come towards you, trying to be in your energy. Yep. Somebody that y'all got y'all going y'all hard again. So be, you know, be careful because the past is coming back. But what does the collector need to know or be aware of for the coming weekend? What does the collector need to know or be aware of? Oh, shit. Yeah, that you being watched by somebody who goes to you could be a Virgo. Person is watching you on social media. Look, they acting like everything is fine. Look, if they hiding how they truly feel, and what they truly feel is that they want to rush in and come towards you, Calusa. So look, yeah, wheel of fortune. <laughs> but they feel like they look a change if they come towards you. The justice under the bottom of the deck. So somebody from your past want to come make something right. But they waiting. Maybe for a sign from you because there was a bad ending between you and this person. So maybe this person feel like, you know, you still holding on to whatever happened in the past. And they watching to see, you know. But this person is definitely acting like everything is good. But they hide their true feelings. Their true feelings is that they want to rush in and come towards you. But... Right now, this person could be receiving karma. They are on the bottom of the wheel. <laughs> Why is the wheel of fortune here? For what the collective can expect for the coming weekend. Uh oh. Uh oh, collective. There's a brand new beginning in love that may come towards you this weekend. Oh, somebody coming back for another chance. Okay. Yeah, after seeing things from a different perspective. Okay. Look. 
This is all they think about is you giving them another chance. You giving them another chance, collecting. <laughs> Constantly watching you. They want child. Look, yeah, this is that person that lied. King of Swords in the reverse. This is that person that lied to you. They they were detached. They were dishonest. You know what I'm saying? This person probably got a lot of fucking attention. Now they want to take action and come towards you and want to reconcile with you. But again, mm, I just kind of feel like you're untouchable. You're in this untouchable ass energy. Look, the emperor in the reverse. Yeah, y'all in this untouchable ass energy, especially when it comes to whether or not you feel like your divine masculine or the person that you were dealing with in divine masculine energy is healed. <laughs> y'all feel like this person ain't healed. But y'all may be ignoring this person, doing your own thing. Everything is fine. This person is act they act like they cool with what's going on between you and them, but they not. Eight of Pentacles, yeah. This person, they act like they okay with, you know, you just focusing on work or you working on yourself, holding back from them, ignoring them, but they really not okay with it. They know he pissed off about it. With this emperor in the reverse, they feel like they, you know, done lost control of the situation. Three of Pentacles. This person feel like you are working on a relationship with somebody else. Child. Child, this person is sad. They miserable. So it's like if they can't have you, they're going to tell themselves all the reasons why they can't have you. But she focused on her money or he focused on their on they money. Or oh, they with a third party. They, you know, they dealing with a third party. Or oh, now they they think they better than. They don't move. They, like so many things are going through this person. Hey, because they feeling like they don't miss some type of opportunity with you. Look, the Ten of Swords, yeah, you're, this person is definitely not happy because whatever they did to you is being done to them. The money. See? Can I make it up? What, if they were sneaky, somebody's being sneaky with them. Page of Pentacles, shit. Somebody's breadcrumbing them, <laughs> shit. If they breadcrumbed you, somebody breadcrumbed them. Three of Swords and the Five of Wands, baby. All they, your person is dealing with a lot of drama this weekend, you collected. They are definitely dealing with a lot of drama. And they stressing about it. This person having sleepless nights, but they did it to themselves. Your person is learning a lesson. And they, they the only ones that can free themselves from this situation or from this lesson. But the shit, they definitely dealing with a lot of damn burdens. The same shit that happened to you is happening to them, but I feel like to the 10th degree. Yeah, because they were selfish. The person that they chose to deal with is selfish and sneaky and, and they are breadcrumbing. And low key, this person want to rush in and be with you and tell you that they want to be with you, but the universe is definitely blocking them. Knight of Swords. Knight of Swords. So even if your person don't reach out to you this weekend, they're going to definitely be thinking about reaching out to you. Look, you have to see it's being blocked. Communi even if you don't have this person blocked, the universe is blocking this baby. They blocking communication. They blocking this person from coming towards you. They block uh, because for some of y'all, this person could be trying to rush in and come towards you because they see you in this Ten of Pentacles energy and now they regret ever turning their motherfucking back on you. That's the truth. Some of y'all are here some type of glow up. And the universe can tell that whoever this person is, they in this opportunist energy where they they not doing so good in this other relationship so why not go back to the collective child please but they being blocked baby see what i'm saying they being blocked from coming to disturb your ten of cups <laughs> but they want you they want you but it's being blocked because for some of y'all this person only want to come in again because they lack financially and you not you not lacking i mean i feel like there is love in this connection between you and this person but I don't, I don't feel like this person is being genuine in their actions of why they coming back to you. <clears throat> Let's see. What do you make it need to know or be aware of when it comes to this energy? What do you collect the need to know or be aware of when it comes to this energy? Unresolved issues, yeah. That's definitely some unresolved issues that's going on. But I don't feel like these these are not your issues. Lessons are being taught. Exactly. Your person is learning lessons. And it is not your place to try to rescue this person. So for some of y'all, they're going to try to come back towards you only for you to rescue them. Hmm. 
But this ain't your place. This person is being taught a lesson. Ignoring the pain. <laughs> yeah. Because, see, they didn't want to change. They was ignoring the pain. They was ignoring their intuition in the past. So now they have to learn this lesson. There will be a return. Mm -hmm. I told you. That's what's going to happen. This person going to come towards y'all trying to be with y'all and shit. But for some of y'all, this person is still in low vibrational ass energy. And they just want you to help them. I don't know what they need help with, but they going to come in wanting you to help them. So let's see. Let's get some lie to take the cords. So what's the line? What's the truth, spirit? When it comes to this weekend energy, what is the line and what is the truth? What do the collective need to know or be aware of? What is the line and what is the truth? Whoa. Here's that I can't shut for the day I'm big. <laughs> okay. I be trying to move the cords out the way, but shit. I hate all that clutter. What's the lie? And what's the truth? Show me what I need to see. What's the lie? And what's the truth? Truth. Even though they may prefer you with someone of your own race, they aren't against who you love either. So I feel like for some of y'all, like I said earlier, this could have been a mother figure that your person that was a karmic in your person's life. It could have been because of race. But I feel like they are now starting to see that this person like really do love you. They may have wanted you. They may have wanted your person to be with somebody of their own, you know, background, their own race or something like that. But they not against this person being with you, loving you. So the parents, maybe they see, or this family, maybe they see that your person is miserable with this other person. I don't know. Yes, they prefer this person to be with somebody like them. But I feel like somebody is opening up to the idea of your person just, you know, wanting to be with you, even if you're different. What is this? A truth? Their ex was toxic, a liar, and a manipulator. I told you. That's why I said this this weekend, your person gonna be going through some things with this this karmic energy because they're going crazy because they losing. They losing this person. They crying and shit. So they're gonna do anything that they fucking possibly can. Lie, manipulate, all that shit. This is a lie. I need space was a lie. They just wanted time to fuck around. Hmm. Yeah, your person, yeah. They was telling you, oh, I just need space. I just need time to think. I need to get myself together. That was a whole fucking lie. But I feel like y'all know that, though. I feel like y'all already know that, and that's why y'all very guarded towards this person. This is the truth. They don't like drama, but who doesn't love to listen to it? So, you know, they, they were listening to, you know, all the wrong things in the past, especially when it came to you collective. And I do feel like they are regretting it, but I mean, it is what it is. They chose somebody that, that they thought was like them, but this person, well, it was. If they was a liar and they was a manipulator and they was toxic, because that's what's been coming out about the past person, that they were toxic, that they were liar, and that they were a manipulator. So your person met somebody just like them. The lie. They are lying about their successes. They are acting boastful and exaggerating the truth. So your person is pretending like everything is good, but they, but it's not. Remember we did see broke, fake as fuck, stunting, yeah. Your person acting like everything is so good, but it's really not. It's really, really not. <laughs> and this is a lie as well. They lied to you about the reason why they left. They left you for someone else. Mm. Yeah. yeah. They say they changed their ways, but they really haven't. Stupid ass still acting stupid. <laughs> okay, because I said earlier, y'all gonna have to be discerning because this person is coming back. But this person still have not changed their ways. They gonna say they have, but they still gonna do stupid shit. So, you know, Trust your intuition when it comes to this person. And let's get a final message. 
Because, baby, this weekend, it, it's in like whoever your past person is, they're going to be doing a lot of reflecting and a lot of drama is going to be going on around this person. But it's drama that they caused and brought on themselves because they left you to go be with somebody else. <laughs> They told you they needed space, but they really left you to go be with somebody else. And the person that they left to go be with, be with is a whole devil, shit. And they being exposed for being as such. How can you fail if you don't try? Again, your person is determined to try to get you back. <laughs> now, whether or not they will, I don't know. Everything you hear about me isn't true. So this person is coming to plead a case. <laughs> they want you to know everything that you done heard is not true. Now, some of it is, but not everything. Look, and then you got 999, letting go of the past to have a brand new beginning. So it, it's 50-50. It's some of y'all may give this person a chance. Others of y'all may not. Look, it's not true. I know it's me. <laughs> Look, my love is real. Some of y'all may give this person another chance. Y'all may give this person another chance, but you know, again, pray about it and trust your intuition. Because for some of y'all, this person is coming to play on your emotions because they lost the person that they chose over you. Because remember, they chose somebody else over you. The person that they chose over you was fucking crazy. They, they, they was narcissistic. Basically, they was a manipulator. They was a liar. Every whatever they told your person that they was gonna do and what they was gonna have, it was all a fucking lie. And now the truth is being exposed and they see you over here shining and, you know, doing your thing. So they're going to try to spin the block and come back towards you. But don't let them motherfucker. Mm -mm. It's time for y'all to have a new beginning with somebody else. That's all I'm saying. Whether you want to or not, be discerning when it comes to this past person. So I'm going to end it right there.